What's up everybody, how's it going? Halfway Curly here. It's been like what, 13 years or something like that? I don't know. I've been busy, lazy, a little combination of the both. But in the end, I'm still here at the end of the day. But since I'm a lazy bastard, why don't we just start with some Reddit videos? This is the first episode of Reddit Review. Hit it, say with me. Reddit Review, numero uno. And my friends sent me a bunch of, since I'm new to Reddit, they sent me a bunch of different Reddits that they are subscribed to. And I decided to start off with Suspiciously Suspicious, oh sorry, Suspiciously Specific. There we go. And of course, we're going to sort by hot because uh, I don't really know what we're Reddit and it's not a lot. Anyways, the next one. I'm so sorry that I didn't catch that. Your Tinder date comes to welcome you in the bedroom. They excuse themselves and go to the restroom. Leaving you alone in the bed. What is your next move? Look at him Himalayan man. What? Yo, this is a strange subreddit. I don't get the joke. Next one, anyways. We have a private island to search. Female teenagers are Reddit. How would you feel if an older gentleman molested you, kidnapped you, and blew you on his private island? Is this a cry for help? Oh, wait a minute. Uh. Yo, like, I heard some strange things recently about people getting exposed for being quote-unquote predators. But, um, anyways. OP should have wished for 350. 350, I, 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 don't know, I don't know what that means. It would suck if you wished to have, if you had a watermelon, got it, then realized you had a wish and wished on a watermelon. OP, bro, is there something you would like to tell us? This is a strange subreddit, guys. I get, uh, it's pretty strange overall. And this one is titled Hmm. Booty shorts with two QR codes on the ass that lead to a PDF of the Communist Manifesto on a page where you can stream Scooby Doo. Yo, um, I need to know where these are at because you might catch me wearing them. No homo. I'm wearing socks. Cheese Goblin. Sex is cool, but have you ever stood in your kitchen shoveling shredded mozzarella in your mouth straight from a bag like a goblin who escaped after being held captive underground for 57 years? <gasps> Jesus, what a freaking... This what, oh, what I've been through like 17 movies already, 3 novels. Okay, where were we? Uh, escaped for 70 years and broken a store. You know, this is just retarded at the end of the day. What, <laughs> what is this? Interesting company name. Evil Megacorp. Yeah, nothing to see here. Pass by. Wow. Xbox gamers be like... Listen here, you toe-eyed cabbage. I, was, I wasn't born in this world for your fat ass can choke out low-level insults at me. I hope you stub your toe in the dark and have to crawl around your bedroom at 3.57 a.m. in horror and horrific pain after going in the kitchen for a midnight snack of cheese and crackers. You absolute gormless minger. Sorry. And you know, <laughs> what else would you respond with to that? Yeah. Dang. It's pretty sad. Plum as a heritage. I am amazed by people who lose weight with exercise. When I exercise, nothing happens because my DNA thinks I'm I'm a European peasant. Peasant. Sorry guys, I'm a bit dumb. You got to excuse that. Peasant. So it's like, oh, you're running from English. You're running from English again, class. Dine, dine you worry. Uh, was it dine? Dine worry. We we'll keep you plump as a partridge and our last murderous bastards. Ha ha ha. Guys, I'm not a fan of the suburb. I got like one laugh out of it so far. Just stop it. Your homes, like all your homes, has an extra light switch that appears to do nothing when flipped. Nevertheless, you pass it you pat what you pass many idle hours curiously flipping it up and down far away. Enormous dressage horses spawn out of the air in my kitchen. Stop flipping the horse switches, please. God dang, where did I wander into a freaking ma a ma What's that guy's name is? I ruined the joke. Oh, well, move on. Um, this dude has gone through some shit. I, pre I really prefer if a girl would cheat on you within the first three months of a relationship. Not these spawns of Satan that waste five years of your life after being introduced to them and you know their family and their ancestors. Then they go cheat on you. Then when you break up with... Then when you break... Wait, what? Then when you break up, you got okay. You gotta go sacrifice a goat at the grave of your grandfather to apologize for introducing them to a hoe. How much would the goat cost? Do you know? Man, the amount of times I felt this is a lot. Sacrifice like two beetles. You know, you know, or you can just play Juice World at nighttime. Always fix his broken hearts. 
Is there a hurricane warning anywhere right now? How fast would a hurricane winds need to be to lift up a 210 pound lib? I was gonna say lib. And six foot two man. First off, god dang, six foot two. Maybe I'm still growing, um, but I hope to be at least six foot two. That seems pretty cool. Okay. I'm assuming these are custom made. My dick smells like chapstick. I'm the reason his dick smells like chapstick. Couple goals, everyone. If you and your girlfriend don't have shirts like this, then can you even call yourself a couple? <sighs> Get in the bin. <laughs> Spit on you. Hmm. Baby Nut was born February 2nd, 2020, in the Super Bowl. Oh, the Super Bowl. On August 11th, Mr. Peanut Corporation tweeted a video of his 21st birthday. Thus, he ages at a rate of 0 0.10 uh, number uh, years a day. Average mile, uh, average, ma why say mile? I'm, forgive my grammar, yo. Average male life expectancy is 67 to 88 years. Baby now will most likely die between October 8th, 6th or April. Whoa, that's not that long, yo. RIP, let's just pull out the Bible, start praying for our boy. He ain't lasting too long. Someone on Corora might be planning something. Would it be illegal to build a huge copper statue of Adolf Hitler in Texas? Anyways. Hmm. 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 Yeah, um, I'm practicing my villager voice because, you know, this YouTube thing isn't going so well. Maybe it'll blow up in soon, but uh, I might have to become the voice actor of the villager soon. But anyways, if I got arrested, what would you think I did? Alright guys, welcome to comment time. This is the time where you have to drop a comment right now. Or else, you are not part of Boba Gang. If you're not part of Boba Gang, get out of here. But anyways, um, if you think I would've got a hang on. If I got arrested, what would you think I got arrested for? Type it down in the comment sections. It could be whatever. Obviously, if it's like mass murdering a whole population, I might have to like, you know, delete that comment. I gotta have Christian channels, maybe-ish. How about Catholic channel? Cause you know, they're a little cooler. <laughs> Should I be scared of how my friend wrote this in three minutes? So I was thinking of a shotgun, then lava. Hmm, yes, excellent plan. How should I tell this? Uh, uh, how about I tell you a more precise plan? First, poison it. It will do more damage to the body and resolve a lot of pain, but not enough to kill. Second, trap her since the body, it is weak, it would be easy. Third, of course, oh sorry, <coughs> this voice is a little Of course, still knife. Cut into pieces, shotgun for fun. Fourth, then go to a place with lava. So we travel. Fifth, to the location at night. I have special, I have extra hands. Do it specifically for the lookout. Yo, if my friend never sent this, um, yeah, they not my friend no more. Serial, serial killers, yeah, get out of here. If you killed someone, get out of my channel, yo. Like, um, yeah, just get out. Sounds like someone made a mistake. Oh my, oh, the same freaking post. Why is it everywhere? I'm just, I don't downvote, but boom. Oh, don't tell the FBI. I don't got an account. Sounds like someone's a little too upset. Young Link mains after melee can't fight. All they do is throw, they boomerang, up B, got a shield, mash up, spot dodge, shoot arrows, and lie. Yo, I used to be a Smash Bros player. I thought I was the best of all time. I won this tournament at my middle school. You know, well, first off, I ran the tournament. It was my tournament, so maybe it would be like really bad if I won my own tournament. But yo, I made like 50 bands. Well, not bands. What am I saying? What am I, a rapper? Basically, I had a sponsor, and that sponsor was gonna give $50 to first place and like $30 to second place. And basically, I ran everything. I had to get my Nintendo Switch, my friend's Nintendo Switch, TVs. Uh, I ran it out the gym of my middle school. And then, uh, for some reason, we did this on Black History Month, you know? Like, of all days to do this, uh, why not that day? But we did it on that, like, special day of the school, celebrating Black History Month. And I overall just smashed everyone. Everyone was pretty garbage. I took out my competition early, but then my cousin, who we always go like we smash all the time, uh, basically, he defeated me in the first round. And but luckily for me, there was one spot available on the other side of the bracket, and I just begged the sponsor to let me do it again. And he said, "Yeah, luckily for me." And I just destroyed everyone else, and then I won first place. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, if you want free money, just make a competition of something you're good at and win the money. How are you? If you ask a coworker how are you and they say, well, I'm here, 
That Lily transfers, I need you to push me off the roof. We can make it look like an asset. If I die, I'm finally free. If I live, we'll sue this place and split the money. Please, for the love of God, help me. All right, you heard it here. So next time I tell you, well, I'm here. You already know what to do. Um, my broken legs will be a price to pay, but I think we'll make more than enough money back. Dura. My first meme. When a girl says daddy, when girl says daddy passed, the salt and you and her dad reach it but you remember you're in your own house i'm the daddy here hilarious i give this a down vote oopsie don't tell nobody please hey yo um i think i'm normal though so hopefully you are but based on the title that i'm gonna assume you're not did you did your high school take drunk driving so seriously that they staged a biannual car accident with actual students so you had to watch at least one of your friends die while one kid had to go to fake court and feel like it was it was to listen to his parents. Wait, hang on. Oh, oh my God, I can't read. Ah, oh. with actual students, so you had to watch at least one of your friends die while one kid had to go to fake court and feel what it was like to listen to parents of people they killed. Or are you normal? Yeah, my like school is gay. Gotta say that. Why? Would you let your sister crash at your place and take care of her for a week after her breast? augmentation surgery uh, augmentation augmentation anyways surgery from a repugnable clinic near your place Why? you know i'm kind of confused but yo if like anybody needs some help i would gladly to help mr beast is my hero i'm to be just like him but like, the difference between me and mr beast is i'm a greedy bastard me give like two two percent of money to the people who need enjoy your meal thank you too me oh my god this is so relatable guys so relatable wrong subreddit get lost when a nine-year-old me oops let's go back when nine-year-old me had a stick oh my god when nine-year-old me had a stick i found and the sun was out and i had a shadow childhood memories relatable but wrong subreddit oh get out of here mm. relatable what did i say the wrong subreddit i think this is a subreddit for relatable wrong subreddit <laughs> wrong subreddit get lost you punk is that aimed with waves mm -hmm. that's what i'm talking about but anyways thing i got bored of this subreddit um i think i rushed so low that we got four uploads down here but yo if you guys found this video entertaining make sure you slap like because I'll do another one if you guys like it. If not, maybe we'll not do it no more. Because, you know, at the end of the day, I got to appease the fans. Anyways, this has been your boy, Halfway Boba. Peace out.